Hey guys, this is Steven, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make something reflect in After Effects. We're going to make something a little bit that looks like this today. It's going to, it can either be text or picture, anything that you want, and there's going to be two options of doing this. So let's get started with the first option, which is if you do not have that plugin called VC Reflect. So I'm just going to type up something, such as CC Multimedia, looks fine. And then what we're going to do is hit Control D, which will make a duplicate copy. And for right now, we're going to rename this bottom. What we're going to do, we're going to select that. And we're going to take this top one right here and just drag the thing down so it reverses like that. And it should be lined up perfectly. And I'm just going to drag this down a little bit. Right there. And we're not done yet. What we have to do now is put a mask on it. So with the bottom selected, right there, we're going to come up to here, the mask tool, it's fine as a rectangle, I'm going to take it, I'm going to cut one about halfway through it, just like that, and then on this mask, I'm going to hit F for feather, I can drag up the feather a little bit, and also I can take the bottom layer and press T for opacity, and I'll just turn the opacity down a little bit. Now that's a nice little looking reflection right there. Now to make this the same layer, so they're not two separate things, we will just take one and then hold shift or control, control in this case, hold it to select the other one, go up to layer, pre-compose, and then hit OK. And now it's one object, oh, excuse me, it is one object now, and that'll be more of a fixed position. Now method two is called or it's a plugin used VC Reflect. It's by Video Copilot. I will show you. We'll do a new text. Same thing. CC Multimedia. And with this plugin, it'll automatically create a reflection based off of whatever you do. So again, it can be text or whatever, a text or picture or video or whatever you want. Video Copilot, VC Reflect, and um, what you need to do first is bring the floor up. So I'm going to bring my floor right here. And it already has some of the built in settings. You can mess with these settings reflection distance, reflection fall off, you know, all that stuff. And what a cool thing about this is, is since it sets the floor right there, you can select this and move it so it can be closer, whatever that position is, that's where the floor meets it. So you can move all around and it'll have a perfect distance on both sides. I recommend getting this plugin, it's really cool. And that's pretty much it for this tutorial guys. Uh, I hope you like this video, you can comment on it, like it, subscribe if you want to. Uh, we have a website, the link will be in the description. I'll also give a link to this VC Reflect, I believe it's a free plugin by Video Copilot. You should go check them out, they have some cool stuff. Alright, thanks guys for watching, see you later.